He was saying in my fight that I actually kicked well. Like he said that my kicks were beautiful, but I was just too far away. My opponent was much bigger than me. She was about seven kilos bigger, which is like 15 pounds. Um, and because she was bigger, me staying far away was not helping me. And so I was trying to say to him, because he's saying stay closer, stay in your knee range. I'm like, when she's that much bigger, and every time I entered into the clinch, she was winning in the clinch because she was just too big, like I was getting stuck. I'm like, every time I grabbed, I lost, so I don't know how to stay close and not grab. You were too close. So there's this range that's not clinching. It's knee range. Yeah. And he wants me basically to touch hands. He's like, if you're touching hands, this is your range against a big opponent like that. Because at this range, she can't kick. And you have these knees to just barrel down. See how I can just keep striking from this range? This is the range he wanted me to fight this girl at. And I could have. Because she was bigger, she had advantages just by her size that I could have avoided by kind of staying on her with this daw 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 thing, like wearing her down. He wants me to move more in the clinch, which is similar to what he's talking about in this keeping my hands on his hands. He's trying to get me away from just locking and being very hesitant and stagnant. He's complaining that I was, I had him against the ropes and was punishing him, and then I just kind of let him out. Up, you have to have a new trigger because you're now your trigger is to leave. When, when his knee, knee comes up, up as a block, I get out because I'm like I can't knee. When that knee comes up, but when yeah. the knee comes up, I should see it as a trip. See how I stumble out after this? If I knee and then stumble out, I should kick immediately. The stumble. It's not going to come out right away. Like, it's a habit. So just put something on the end of it that helps me. See how keeping him on the ropes here, I have a variety of strikes. And I don't have to rush. He wants me to push his arms, like fold them down. I get slightly confused when this game continues for a long time. But... If I don't think too much about it, it's it's pretty intuitive. But that that close range, that mean range, is super super easy.